Have you ever stopped to wonder what a seed is? It might seem like a simple question, but the answer is full of fascinating science. So buckle up and let's embark on a journey to discover the wonderful world of seeds. A seed, in the simplest terms, is a tiny plant waiting to grow. It's the way plants reproduce, carrying the genetic information from two parent plants. Each seed holds a miniature plant called an embryo, along with food to fuel its growth once it gets the right conditions. Picture a seed as a survival package. It's a plant to be, bundled up with its own lunchbox, waiting for the perfect moment to sprout. This is why seeds can survive in harsh conditions and over long periods of time. They're in a state of dormancy, a sort of plant hibernation, waiting for water, warmth and light to kickstart their growth. Now, seeds come in all shapes and sizes. You have the mighty coconut, the tiny orchid seed, and everything in between. But despite their differences, all seeds share a similar structure. They consist of three main parts, the embryo, the endosperm, and the seed coat. The embryo is the new plant in miniature form. It has the rudimentary parts of a mature plant, the root, stem, and leaves. The endosperm, on the other hand, is the food supply. It's packed with starches, proteins, and fats that will nourish the growing plant. Lastly, the seed coat is the protective outer layer. It shields the precious cargo inside from disease, insects, and damage. There are two main types of seeds, monocots and dicots. Monocots have one seed leaf or cotyledon, while dicots have two. This difference affects how the seed germinates and grows into a mature plant. So to recap, a seed is a miniature plant with a packed lunch, covered in a protective coat, waiting for the right conditions to start growing. It carries genetic information from two parent plants and comes in two types, monocots and dicots. Understanding seeds is not only fascinating but also crucial. They are the starting point for most of the food we eat, the clothes we wear, and the oxygen we breathe. So, the next time you see a seed, remember, it's not just a tiny object, it's a tiny miracle of nature, full of potential and life. Thank you for joining this journey into the world of seeds. Hopefully, you now have a newfound appreciation for these tiny powerhouses of life. Until next time, keep wondering, keep exploring, and keep learning.